All right, everyone, I'm gonna do a quick video on commands on the bench press. Uh, people who want to get involved with piloting here with Mark. Mark's been around the bench a few times, you can tell. Um, so we're gonna talk about commands and uh, what we, like for most federations, these are the general commands. A lot of people come in the, from the gym and they do like a touch and go or they bounce it off their chest. And it's really important that people understand that in the sport of powerlifting, you have three commands usually, depending on the federation. You can get a spotter to unload it for you, you can unload it. The bar is gonna be in a straight position. It, where, when it's in a dead stop position, you'll get a command from the ref behind you saying, start, you'll bring it down. It'll, once it looks motionless on your chest, you'll get press, and then you wait and you'll get a rack command. And there's some nuance with these commands, which I'll go into in the next video uh, in a bit. But let's just go over commands really quickly. So Mark's gonna get down. We'll bring it up. He's, we're gonna wait for it to be motionless. He's in control. Say start. Press. Rep. And that's about it. Notice it wasn't that long of a rest on his chest, but the refs are going to be looking that the bar is not moving and that it is motionless. Okay, we'll talk a little bit more on that in the next video. And then the rack showing that it's in full locked out at the top. You can't just bring it back and rack it when you're done. You have to show control at the top to get the command. If you beat any of those commands or do it before the referee says, then you'll get red lights instead of white lights. All right, and we'll talk a little bit in the next video about some nuance with these rules.